Yo, what is up guys? Apathy back in the building today with another video and this is long due. Like, I was supposed to do this before I left to ESWC. I pretty much did the video, things were wrong, I don't know what happened during the rendering or what happened, but the video was just cutting out halfway, so I deleted the video. So today I'm going to be doing an MLG Atlanta and ESWC post uh, vlog and talking about the event, but I'm going to do it a little bit faster since I'm doing two events in one, and you know, really talk quickly about what went down and what went wrong and what could have been better. So a lot of you guys know we placed third at MLG Atlanta, which is pretty good, but then we placed ninth through 12 at ESWC, which is uh, pretty damn bad. And I was very disappointed, you know, I was pretty happy with third place, not like super ecstatic, but you know, it's a good placing, we got a lot of pro points. And it was it was just a good placing overall, you know, coming back from placing 9 through 12 at Las Vegas. And then we go to ESWC and place 9 through 12, and that's just, like, so disappointing, so heartbreaking. You know, we I thought we were finally doing good. I thought we could do better. And then, boom, we just, you know, shit the bed. So let's start off with MOG Atlanta. Our pool consists of Fnatic, Orbit, United, and RNG came into our pool. Uh, we ended up going 3-1 in our pool. Not the best because, you know, you get the second seed, you're going to play a really good team off the break. But United just came out pretty hot against us. Uh, I felt like we weren't playing as our, like usually the way we play. And they ended up, ended up beating us, I think, 3-1 in pool play. Orbit Fnatic match were pretty easy for the most part. You know, not much to say about those matches. We just came out hot and we did our thing. And we, we won them pretty, like, you know, pretty easily. You know, it's I'm not roasting them, but it's the way it is. And then uh, RNG, uh, they pretty much, our, our match didn't really matter. They, I'm pretty sure they didn't even care as much. We didn't even care as much. We just went to, and we won 3-0. So we ended up going 3-1 in our pool. Next match we had to play was versus Optic. Now, this always happens to us, you know, this fucking bracket shit. And it really sucks. And we put ourselves in that position because we could have potentially played, I think, Splice first. But instead, United beat us. So United get to play Splice. We play Optic. But this has been, you know, this happened to us many times. We weren't that, like, concerned about it. You know, we were used to this. We are used to playing a hard team right away. So right off the bat, we play Optic. Uh, not really back and forth during the hard points. For the most part, I believe we won by, like, 70, 80 points, both hard points. Uh, and S&D was extremely close. They almost came back. You know, we were, like, up 5-2. They almost came back, but we managed to win the last round. And, it, and then the uplink, you know, they won the uplink. We, just, we need a little bit of work on uplink. But we win the Series 3-1. You know, we're top six. We're really happy. We just beat Optic. Very good team coming to this event. And, you know, we're just, we see the improvement already. Now, our next match was versus LG. Luminosity Gaming. Now, obviously, they're a really talented team. They're a really good team. Very talented, like I said. And, you know, we knew it was going to be a pretty good match, but we played them many times, you know, online. You know, we almost beat them at Las, Las Vegas. We played them for top eight. We lost 3-1, but, like, all the maps were extremely close. And, you know, we just wanted a little bit of revenge time. So, uh, for the most part, I believe we won 3-1 or 3-0. I think it was 3-1. Uh, but for the most part, uh, we were just playing good. We were on our game, you know, pretty convincingly win. You know, nothing too crazy, nothing too out of the out of the normal we just played good call of duty and we know it was up it was really early in the morning it was like a 9 30 10 or it was like a 10 10 30 uh, am match but we came out with the fire we did good we played good and now we're top three so now we're top three you know we're still in winner's bracket this is this is the this is the best way to win an event you if you go to grand finals through winner's bracket your your chances increase by like 20 30 percent just because they have to beat you two best of fives and they also are coming from losers bracket so they you know they just they're just eventually they're gonna burn out so this is a good thing we're happy next match is versus EU united now, we lost them in our pool play match. You know, it, we felt like pool play, we didn't go as hard. We didn't play as good. You know, so it wasn't, it didn't really show their full potential and our full potential. So, going to the United match, you know, we're like, all right, we got this. Let's do this. And first map, you know, uh, we just didn't slay enough. You know, I, I John and I could have slayed a little bit more. Uh, they ended up winning, winning by like 30, 40 points. Not a crazy lead, but we could have easily won first map. I know Gunless went off that map. And then second map search, uh, just doing stupid shit like, guys, you don't understand. We're getting first blooded almost every round. Like we're we're just not we're not we're like out of it. I don't know what it was. You know, we, we just weren't in the game. We weren't playing as a team. We weren't a team. And then third map, they just win the uplink by crazy. I think it was Frost uplink. They win like a last second one. Uh, Sally somehow sneaks by, gets the one. It was stupid. Like they shouldn't even have won that map either. So like we potentially choked. At least, at least two maps. I don't know. We definitely choked the third map, but it's just stupid how how everything went down. So we lost 3-0 to United. Uh, some of the maps were pretty close. We could have it could have gone either way. 
and you know just poor poor like playing and poor teamwork and poor communication from our team you know just something that i felt like we weren't all there we were out of it so we ended up losing 3-0 to united now we're still top three we played the we play optic optic made it all the way through you know they came out with the fire they were hot they were gunning i was watching them they were making crazy comebacks see apparently they got went like a 5-2 comeback from panda to win you know it was insane like all these things literally insane so we were playing a very very hot optic like burning hot like i've done loser bracket runs before like when you get to the like unless until you get to grand finals then you start burning out a little bit but you're just just going just rolling 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 just gunning and beating people and outplaying people like they shouldn't have gone that far like i said they made like a 5-2 comeback versus panda to win last map like they did crazy comebacks throughout the whole tournament but they did it you know and now they're playing us and we just they just came out hot <laughs> They were gunning me. They were gunning my whole team. You know, the only person who played pretty good for his first map was like J Cap. Uh, us, other, us, other three could have played a little better. Uh, it was a poor performance. I know John had a bad map. You know, S and D. Uh, man, they just, they just ran us, bro. Throwback. They won like six one. We just weren't playing like ourselves. Uh, we just, we just weren't there. Like we just didn't come. We just didn't come out of play. Like it really sucks. You know, I, I, like I said, I know how that loser bracket run is, and I know how you're just on fire and like you're just gunning. You're not missing. You're not. You're barely making any bad plays. You're just your team's on point. You know, it's just it's crazy. But you know, no excuses, man. They beat us. They destroyed us, and it really sucked losing like that. But that was pretty much our last map match. You know, lost 3-0. You know, the uplink. Uplink. The uplink is the only map we should have won. Uh, I made a stupid play. We had like a couple other stupid plays, and they won like barely won. But that was that was stupid. We should have potentially won that map. Not sure if we would have won the hard point next, but you know, might have, might have possibly. You know, we could have probably done it. And it just it sucks though. They won 3-0. You know, they knocked us out of the tournament. We played top three. Okay, we lost to United, who wins the event, and we lost to hot hot on fire optic which optic you know we just won the swc and they're obviously a really good team so we lost to pretty two pretty like a top three let's say top three top four teams so not too bad you know play top third you know play stop play top three you know now we're gonna go to eswc time to do our thing maybe talk over some a couple stuff and you know hopefully do better at this event all right so now we're in eswc we are in paris you know we're like all right let's do better let's do this like we know what we're made of we had we saw our potential at atlanta we can do this we could possibly win this event let's just go hard and do our thing so we had a first round buy in open bracket yes we were an open bracket that shit sucks but it is what it is you know can't can't do anything about the system but we had a buy second match was just like pools gaming or something like that uh european team we ended up winning 3-0 then our next match was between either stdx or red or old red reserve haggy's team uh, i was watching that match you know uh stdx when stdx ended up beating them the last map uplink 2-1 and it was pretty crazy and then so we were like oh shit so i guess we don't play haggy's team so we play stdx uh i believe like the map the search was pretty close they almost came back or something but we ended up winning 2-0 and then our last match to get out of open bracket and go to pool play was this versus eg evil geniuses now this is a team who's coming out with the fires coming out hot who's giving it their all because they need to place well at this event if they don't place well at this event this is pro points that could potentially cost them a league spot and, you know cost them a lot of things so they need to do well so we played a hot so we played a eg that wanted it bad uh, it was obviously a best of three open bracket match. Stupid, I know. Get out of pool play. Best of three last match. They should have at least made it a best of five. But uh, we won the first hard point uh, pretty convincingly. I believe we won by like 100. Nah, not 100. I'm guessing. Like 70, 80 points. You know, nothing too crazy. Uh, but then the search and destroy was just back and forth, back and forth. We were up 2-1. Then they're up 3-2. And then it's just back and forth. And it, I ended up going 5-5. We clutched up 4 four down 4-5. We clutched up 5-5. And we went we went five five after being down four five, and you know I got picked. Uh, it was unfortunate I got picked. I had kinetic armor. You know we managed to get so far. And if I stayed alive, we put, we could have potentially easily won that that round, and we would have won two zero. But you know shit happens. I got picked. Lesson learned. You know I'm not gonna sit in the same position I did that day. And then we go to last map uplink frost uplink. Now this map we are cursed on. We've lost it many times. Plenty, plenty, plenty of times. You know, this is the map that I have nightmares about. This is the map that we played at Atlanta at least like six, five, at least five times. We played about seven matches at Atlanta. We played Uplink Frost at least five times. And guess what? We lost it every single time. 
every single time. I don't think we won it once that event. And it's not like losing crazy, like last second donk, last second one, last second miracle play by them. Like everything was like last second. Like it's so close throughout the whole match, and then it was terrible. But it was uplink frost. We're like, all right, we got this. This is gonna be our first uplink. We we win. And it was just back and forth, back and forth. They should have won, then we should have won, then they should have won, then we should have won. And it was just, cra it was a really intense, crazy last map. Like, this is like, we're all probably just like sweating, nervous, like, oh my god, what the fuck is going on, like, type of shit, you know, like, this is crazy. And then, it, and then they score an overtime, it did go overtime, they score an overtime with like a minute, no, like two, almost two minutes. And then we almost choked, then we almost scored, and we choked, and it's like a minute left. And then we, we almost score again, then they intercept it again, and we choke, and it's like 40 seconds left. And then we, we get the ball close to their base. And then I, all I remember is Cap going for the one. He slid during, like, if you slide going for a one, and, like, the, the, the ball just goes so low for some reason. So if you ever slide going for one, you got to overthrow it. But he didn't. He kind of messed up. Obviously, it's like that's so hard to like predict, you know. And it's really random. Like you, that, that requires practice for you to perfect how how high you need to throw it. But he slid and went for the one where I was legit about to just, oh my god, we won! Like I was literally about to like jump up and go like, let's go. But he slid and went for the one. It just completely just goes a bloop. It misses, and I'm like, oh shit! And I, I had to, I had to refocus. Slasher was about to like get up too. And then he had to refocus. And then, like, he ended up getting a two-piece. I think I helped him kill one guy as well. And then he just easily gets the dunk. So I was like, thank God, bro. Like, we almost choked that so, so freaking bad. Like, I would have I would have lost my mind. So we moved on to pool play. You know, we did it. We're happy about that. We had Splice, Phase, and XIV or XTV. Something along those lines. I, completely, I forgot the name just because it's a little complicated. I apologize. So, you know, this pool was really important because if you get second in your pool, you play Optic. If you get first, you play like Orbit or Epsilon or something along those lines. It might have been Epsilon. So, you know, obviously you want first in your pool because no offense, you know, playing Epsilon or Orbit versus playing Optic. Uh, yeah, I would rather take that as a top six match rather for, you know, play Optic for a top six match. So we ended up be beating Splice like 3-0. Uh, the maps, like two of the maps were pretty close. You know, it was it was nice. It was a nice little performance. You know, we're happy about that. Then our next match was versus FaZe. Now, first map, pretty close. Um, it, you know, it was just like like two 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 like two little mistakes. You know, win a gunfight there, win a gunfight here. You know, do something, do the right play here, and we could have easily won that map. We ended up losing by like 30, 40 points. Uh, it really sucked, but it is what it is. Then the search. You know, they just played it really well, but we played it kind of stupid at times. Uh, we lost like 6-3 or 6-4. And then the uplink, uh, I, th I believe we won the uplink. I'm pretty sure we won the uplink. And then we went to, um, did we win the uplink? No, I think we lost the uplink. But whatever, FaZe ended up beating us. You know, it's kind of it kind of sucks. Like, just losing. It sucks losing, man. It just really does. Like, I hate it. But we lost the phase. We're like, okay, you know what fucking sucks. We're probably going to play Optic first. But whatever, let's just beat uh, this next team and make sure we get out of pool play and winners. So we beat the next team like 3-1. They managed to win the search or something. I don't know how the fuck that happened. They were just, this guy was quick scoping the shit out of us. This guy's a god. But we ended up winning 3-1. We got second in our pool and we ended up playing Optic first. Now our Optic match was a complete shit show. If you guys watched it, we got 3 0 uh, The first map hard point, uh, it was pretty close actually. We lost only by like 40, 50 points. And it just demoralizing because, you know, John had a, a little bit of a bad performance. I started off hot, dude. I started off like 7-2 or something like that and i slowed down i ended up like 20 and 25 or something like that but uh you know if john just picked it up a lot and i just played a little better and like not if i didn't slow down i felt like we could have easily won about like 70 80 points and you know it sucks man it happens you know a teammate you know i'm i'm gonna have one or a teammate here and there's gonna have one that's something we need to work on a little bit i feel like we need to stop shitting the bed as much like having a player shit the bed and tr like everyone perform for the most part like it's gonna happen once a while it's gonna happen obviously we're not we're not human you know we're just gonna have unlucky timing we're not gonna play well but like would that happen the, the, that happens to our team like against like a top three top four team that happens to our team almost every single map and it's just really bad because that's just that's just it's so hard to win a map three before you know but it sucked you know it happened to search and destroy they were up like five two and i was like I was like, come on, we could do this, guys. We could do this, man. The user specialist, let's go. And we ended up bringing it back, I think, 5-4? No, we ended up bringing it back 5-5. Five, five. And, I, oh, my God, dude, it was a 4v4. We brought it back 5-5. Five, five, and we planted the bomb. I thought we were going to do this. We have this. 
and then I got killed, and then my teammates got killed, and then it sucks because we played that 5-5 a little stupid. We could have played that so much better, but it happened. You know, we lost that map. We're like, fuck, that was the map. If we win that map, we potentially go to game five, or maybe we win 3-1, but that was the momentum map. That was the map we needed, and we just didn't win it. Then we were down 2-0, uplink throwback next, and, you know, they, they, just, they had the momentum. They had the energy. I mean... I don't know what happened, dude. I, I I was I played pretty well on map, you know. I was using a sub slaying, but they won by like five six points. Uh, they they were just making the plays, they were getting the kills, and just nothing. They just won. They won three zero. So now we're losers bracket, you know, after a pretty bad defeat versus Optic, and we had to play Splice for top eight. Uh, Splice ended up beating United, so we had to play Splice. And Splice, you know, we beat them in pool play. You know, nothing too crazy. And we know they're still a good team. You know, we're not going to take them lightly. But we had to play Splice again. So it is what it is. Whatever. We're playing Splice for top eight. Not, not really nervous. Just, you know, ready to play this match. Want to win. Want to win bad. So first map retaliation. Close map. We lose by like 20 points. 20, 30 points. They had full streaks off the first hill. Two of them got full streaks. I don't know how. Don't ask me how. But that helped them so much as the game went on because they got us off so many hills with those streaks, which is really frustrating because, you know, if they didn't have those streaks, we could have easily won that map at least. Like, and it just sucks. Whatever. We lost first map. Then we had second map, you know, search and destroy. We lost like 6 4. Uh, Crusher, we just need work on Crusher, man. We got to do shit together more or something. But, you know, we could have easily won that map. Fortunately, we lost. And then we're down 2-0. And then at that point, you know, same thing. When the team's up 2-0 and after a crazy, like a really good search win, you know, the momentum just carries on. You know, they're not losing. They're on fire. You know, they want it bad. And then they just won the precinct like 14-1 or something. 14-2. I don't know, man. They won by like 10 to 14 points. They demolished us. So we lost 3-0. I'm fucking upset. I'm like, this is fucking trash. Like, how the fuck did we lose this bad? You know, like... We lose to Optic 3-0, we lose to Splice 3-0, like, not even close maps. I mean, some maps were kind of close, but still, like, it just, it's like they dominate us, you know? So we ended up getting 9 through 12 at ESWC, you know, just, it, what really hurt us at times, like I said, was individual performance, you know, individually, you know, someone would just do bad, really bad, or like, it just like go double neg like on the hard point and then go double neg and up like i'm not i'm not pointing at anyone but i'm saying like this is consistently happening happening like it could be me one, one map then it's slasher one map then it's john one map then it's jcap one map like it's just consistently a thing and obviously like i said it's gonna happen we're gonna have bad maps here and there it's gonna happen like no one's perfect you're gonna get outplayed you're gonna get outgunned sometimes maybe you're just not doing well on that map but like, we just need to lower it down. Like, something that we, what made us really good in Black Ops 3, you rarely ever see a shit the bed. Like, a teammate shit the bed. Like, it happens once in a while, and we still somehow win a map, or we we lose. You know, we still somehow win a map. Our teams are picking it up. You know, someone's just going off and carrying that guy doing bad. Or, you know, we just lose, and we move on. But, like, in Black Ops 3, it rarely ever happened. And that's what made us a better team. That's why, like, a lot of these teams are really good, because they're all, like, doing consistently well you know it's just it's hard playing three before at times and you know i'm i'm pretty sure that you know we're all going to come back home we're going to start grinding you know individually as well and, you know get better as as a player and you know obviously bring that skill to the team and then we should all be playing better so i know that's going to happen you know we also had a little mistakes as well search and destroy some mistakes in hard point you know we, we know we know because we we as we were playing we're realizing all the shit that we're doing and it's it's just bad and, you know, even though we did lose to, like, FaZe and we did lose to Optic and Splice, which is potentially, like, a top six Euro team, and they're obviously a really good team, you know, we lost, we mainly lost to all the good teams, right, the best teams. And, you know, you know, it just, it still sucks, though, because we want to be the best. I want to be the best, you know. And I just, I see all these errors and, like, all these mistakes, and I know we can fix it. Put in the search and destroy time. There's times you don't know what to do. There's times you don't know how to do a setup. We don't have good pushes. You know, it's just we know what to do generally. But some of the stuff we do just doesn't work. You know, some of the stuff that's going on doesn't work. Like, this is something we need to practice a little more. But, you know, I'm confident, you know, after especially a hard loss like that. Because I'm very disappointed. I'm very upset. You know, I feel like I let a lot of you get, a lot of you guys down. You know, we played third at Atlanta. And then, boom, we placed, like, top 12, which is fucking shit. Like, not 9th, not 10th, 11th, I don't give a shit. We placed 12th. Like, I don't care. Double-digit placing. Like, that is embarrassing. You know, it's just, it's completely, completely garbage. And I, ah, man, like, I'm I'm really upset. But, you know, I've been, I've been, 
I've been I've been regaining, you know, I've been, you know, being better, you know, I'm feeling better. But I'm just really hoping that we start taking a little bit more serious, you know, have fun with it, but take it a little more serious, you know, like actually, you know, go over things and try to figure things out and, you know, work on things like we did that a lot. But I feel like we're still doing the same mistakes. Like all it requires is a little bit more effort. And I believe like we can easily fix those mistakes and, you know, better be a better team because there's so much stuff to, that's coming up. There's so much big events, you know, the land league and everything. And, you know, I want to be a top I want to be like a top three team by then, like by Dallas. I want to place at least top two again, or I want to win the event. You know, I want to be that caliber, the high caliber team that it's very dominant. You know, I don't want to do that. Like as we're getting to land league. All right, now let's start. Let's start getting better. No, like there's so much to play for. You want to be prepared for that. So either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. You know, I try to skim through it really quickly and just go over things and, you know, talk to you guys really quickly about what went down, the most important things. And just so you guys get an idea of what happened at the events and what we need to improve on, et cetera, et cetera. So thank you anyone who stood throughout the whole thing. You know, it's been a while since I made a YouTube video. I'm going to try to get back on the grind. I know I say this every time, but seriously, man, you know, I'm going to I'm going to loosen up a little bit, you know, try to post a vlog uh, of vlog, not a vlog, but a video almost every single day and, you know, stream, you know, and just have some fun with it, man. So this has been your boy, Apti. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Oops. I'm out. Peace.